Hey everybody, welcome back to day two of Black Stars Week. The scene that my sister Rachel's gonna be drawing today is of Blackfoot bringing back up for Tiger Claw in a fight, proving his loyalty to him. I'll read this scene to you now. It's on pages 64 through 67 of Tiger Claw's Fury. Suddenly, there was the roar of thundering paws, and a voice meowed in Tiger Claw's ear. Did you think we'd let you fight alone? He turned and looked into Blackfoot's hungry gaze. No, my friend, now Tiger Claw, I knew you would come. Blackfoot had brought nearly every cat that wasn't sick with him, including Russet Fur and Ratscar, Tiger Claw noted. As the Shadow Clan cats hurtled across the Thunderpath, Mouse Fur and Whitestorm burst out of the undergrowth. They fought bravely, but the Thunder Clan warriors were sorely outnumbered. Even though Fireheart had managed to wriggle free from Tiger Claw, this wasn't a battle that Shadow Clan would lose. Mowgli rushed forward and sliced Fireheart's hind legs with his claws. Fireheart stumbled, and Tiger Claw reared over him, bracing himself to deliver the death blow. Mowgli's eyes glittered in triumph. There was a searing pain in Tiger Claw's belly. He looked down, baffled. A broad gray tabby warrior had lunged into Tiger Star's exposed stomach, tearing at his newly healed wound. Gray Stripe, what is he doing here? He lives in River Clan. Tiger Claw fell onto his paws and looked around. His cats were fighting more than three Thunder Clan warriors now. It looks like the whole River Clan patrol had come to Fireheart's rescue. Always relying on others for help. Tiger Claw spat. Uh huh, sure. Say it like you don't always rely on other cats too, Tiger Claw. He does. He would be nothing without cats like Blackfoot backing him up and providing him with support. Blackfoot is lucky that his plan worked. Because I can see how it could have gone very, very wrong. Oh yes, let's take all of the healthy warriors in Shadow Clan and run across the Thunder Path. Hmm, what if a semi had rounded the corner? Then it would have gone splat! There goes Shadow Clan! <laughs> so yeah, he's lucky that didn't happen. But it could have. Good thing it didn't. Anyways, Blackfoot and Tiger Claw become close allies, and when Tiger Claw is chosen as Shadow Clan's leader, Tiger Star appoints Blackfoot as his deputy making him deputy for the second time in a row to an edgy brown tabby with interesting ideals. Hmm, I'd love to hear in the comment section down below why you think Blackfoot decided to follow two questionable leaders, backing them up and encouraging their evil plans. Is Blackfoot evil? Or is he just a follower? Who likes to be beside the cat who looks and talks the meanest game? Let me know what you think down below. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video. Make sure to go and check out the video over on the side of my last speed paint. And click that subscribe button so you can always be notified when I make my next video. Alright guys, thank you all so much for tuning in. I'll see you soon with the next speed paint. Bye bye